Dear friends, welcome back. Today I am going to show you how easy it is to send and receive SMS messages with Arduino using the Arduino GSM GPRS shield from TinySign. The shield uses the SIM900 chip. It costs around 20 euros. Arduino can communicate with the shield using 80 commands. With this shield you can send and receive SMS messages, make and receive phone calls and connect to the internet using the GPRS network. All you have to do is to enter your SIM card in the slot at the back of the shield and connect the shield with your Arduino Uno. If you want to use an Arduino Mega, you have to make some changes in the code. We will take a look at this at a future video. The shield requires a lot of current to work. It can draw up to 2 amps. So in order to use the shield, you have to connect an external power supply uh, that has the capability to deliver 2 amps maximum. From my experience though, uh, I saw that uh, sending and receiving SMSs with uh, this shield does not require a lot of current. So today we are going to use the USB port and power the device from the USB port only. So let's send an SMS message and receive it from Arduino. I have connected the GSM to the Arduino Uno. As you can see, the red light is on and the blue light is flashing. When connected, the blue light will flash slowly like this and we are going to see a message in the serial monitor. Then the shield will send uh, an SMS message to my cell phone. We are going to see that. Connection is OK. We are ready. And now the SMS will be received from my cell phone. That's the SMS and a message sent OK in the serial monitor. Now I'm going to reply and see the message in the serial monitor. Hello Arduino. When I, um, when I press the send button, we'll, we will read the message in the serial monitor. Wait a second. That's it. Hello, Arduino. Perfect. Let's now take a look at the code of the project. First of all, you have to download the TinySign library for the GSM GPRS shield. You can find the library in the description of the video. Please note that I don't know if this library works for GSM shields from other makers. Then you have to create a new Arduino sketch and put this code in. Don't forget to disable PIN at your SIM card in order the sketch to work. Then all you have to do is to enter your phone number in this line here. You put your phone number here including the country code. The sketch when it starts it uh, tries to connect to the GSM network and if it is, uh, this is done it uh, prints ready. Then, if it is connected, it sends an SMS message and uh, then it waits for new incoming messages and print them in the serial monitor. It checks for new messages every 2 seconds. The code is very easy and you can find it in the description of the video. That's how easy it is to send and receive SMS messages with Arduino. It is a very useful functionality that we are going to use in many projects to come, so stay tuned. Subscribe to our channel if you want to see our future project and press like if you liked our video. Thank you very much and see you soon.